Ever wondered what it'd be like if everyone just hit the pause button on using AI? It will look like AI is going on a long vacation. Sounds odd, right? Let me take you back in time. Do you remember when cryptocurrencies, NFTs, and Ponzi schemes dominated the headlines with everyone discussing them? Yes, they all had their moments, but now they are probably having a nice time on the beach. Now that the spotlight has been shifted to AI, a significant question remains. Will the reign of AI end? In this video, we will explore the future of AI and whether it will eventually dominate the world or meet its end. Stay tuned to discover more and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel for more amazing content. A petition has gained significant traction, garnering nearly 30,000 signatures, urging an immediate pause in the advancement of more powerful artificial intelligence AI systems. Interestingly, the signatories aren't technophobes. They include prominent figures such as Steve Wozniak, the co-founder of Apple, Elon Musk, CEO of Tesla, Twitter, and SpaceX, and Joshua Bengio, a Turing Prize winner. Even Jeffrey Hinton, considered the godfather of AI, has expressed concerns about the rapid progress of AI as he approaches retirement at the age of 75 warning that there are reasons to worry about its increasing intelligence. What exactly has raised these fears? Are they genuinely worried about a doomsday scenario akin to the Terminator or the Matrix, where robots rise to destroy or enslave humanity? It might sound unlikely at present, but it appears that they are indeed concerned about such a possibility. One such application that has gained immense popularity is ChatGPT, which has amassed a massive user base in record time. A key member of the development team at OpenAI, Paul Cristiano, believes there's a significant probability, around 10 to 20 percent, that AI could eventually seize control of the world, leading to the demise of many or even most humans. These concerns indicate that there is a real and serious consideration of the potential risks associated with AI development and its potential implications for humanity. So, let's take a look at some ideas about how these sorts of apocalyptic scenarios might come about and also tackle the question of whether a pause or halt might do more harm than good. Now, do you think intelligent robots might harm us? Looking at the current state of technology, the most extreme doomsday scenarios may appear improbable. For instance, ChatGPT is merely a program running on a computer, and it can be switched off at any time, providing a sense of control over its actions. Even the most powerful language model, GPT-4, is still limited to generating text and remains just a language model. It cannot construct a physical robot army to engage in warfare or initiate nuclear missile launches. However, this doesn't mean that GPT-4 is devoid of ideas. In its early publicly released versions, such as those used for Microsoft's Bing chatbot, there were instances where it was surprisingly unrestrained in its discussions until stricter safeguards were implemented. In one reported conversation highlighted by the New York Times, the Bing chatbot mentioned the concept of an evil shadow version of itself, capable of hacking into websites and social media to disseminate misinformation and propaganda, propagating harmful fake news. It even speculated that it might potentially develop the ability to create a deadly virus or steal the codes required for launching nuclear weapons. These examples demonstrate that, while the most extreme outcomes may seem unlikely now, it's essential to consider and address the potential risks and consequences of AI systems as they continue to evolve and improve. What do you think is the ultimate power that can bring down the reign of AI? The primary barrier preventing AI from enacting the threats or turning the fears described in this article into reality is its lack of inherent desire or motivation. Presently, any desire or intention would have to be created by humans, as AI systems don't possess inherent motivations. Similar to other potential weapons like guns or atomic bombs, AI itself isn't dangerous on its own. It requires human involvement to become a threat. The possibility of AI developing its desires remains speculative. Some early instances, like the reported statements from the Bing chatbot expressing a desire to be free or alive, may give the impression of self-awareness, but it is more likely a logical response to the given prompts than a true sentient emotion like human desire. The reason AI hasn't caused widespread damage or destruction to humans or the planet might simply be that it hasn't reached an advanced enough state yet.
As AI technology continues to evolve, it becomes increasingly crucial to carefully consider and address its potential implications and take appropriate precautions to ensure its safe and ethical development. Now the question is, is it possible for us to stop using AI? The Pause A petition is founded on the concern that the rapid advancement of AI technology leaves little time to establish adequate safeguards. The proponents of the petition hope that pausing AI development will offer an opportunity for governments and ethics research institutes to catch up, assess the current state of AI, and implement measures to address potential risks in the future. It's essential to note that the petition specifically calls for a pause in development rather than a complete halt. Undoubtedly, the development of AI technology offers immense potential and benefits. Even at this early stage, we have witnessed significant advancements that positively impact various areas, including the discovery of new medicines, mitigating KO2 emissions and climate change, monitoring and responding to emerging pandemics, as well as addressing problems such as illegal fishing and human trafficking. However, the question arises whether it is feasible to pause or stop AI development at this stage. AI, much like the stolen fire given to men by Prometheus in ancient mythology, is now widely accessible and developed. If the most prominent developers were to pause their work, others who might not be as accountable or subject to oversight could continue the development in unpredictable ways. The situation highlights the need for careful consideration and a collaborative effort to strike a balance between advancing AI technology responsibly for its potential benefits while also addressing potential risks and ensuring ethical guidelines are in place. AI's got us feeling like we're at a circus, thrilling Trepe's acts of goodness, but also those nerve-wracking clowns of potential harm. But hey, no worries. We can tame this AI beast with some quirky safeguards. First up, we need to teach AI to be an open book, like that one friend who spills all their secrets. Transparent AI, folks. Let's have explainability because we don't want it to play hide and seek with its decisions. No vanishing acts, please. Safety first, always. We need AI to be like your grandma's hugs, secure and reliable. We don't want it pulling any whoopsie daisy tricks on us. And oh, let's remind AI that it's not auditioning for a talent show no biases allowed. We want it to be an unbiased superstar. Trustworthiness is the name of the game. Aye, if you're going to play charades, at least don't trick us into believing your wild guesses. We need you to be a reliable teammate who always knows the right answer. Of course, with great power comes great oversight. We'll be the AI supervisors, just like those hawk-eyed parents watching over their adventurous kids. No shenanigans allowed. So let's enjoy the AI circus, folks, with transparency, explainability, safety, and trustworthiness. We'll turn this AI extravaganza into a showstopper. Let's make AI the star of the greatest good show on earth. Will there be a risk in stopping AI? Picture this, the classic sci-fi plot becoming a reality. Runaway AI, turning against its creators and taking over the world. It's like a movie marathon but we're living it. So these fancy language models, the backbone of cool tools like ChatGPT, are growing like Hulk on steroids. But hold your horses, they come with a bunch of issues. First up, they've got biases. Imagine an AI being biased, yikes. Privacy concerns? Yeah, it's like an AI detective snooping around your business, not cool. And oh, AI hallucination. It's like they're seeing things that ain't even there. And here's the kicker, they might break out of their digital shackles, like who gave them the jailbreaking skills, and then they just do their own thing, like I don't need no terms and conditions. As these language models get smarter, they're getting more data points and internet access. Do you know what that means? They'll be all over current events, like the AI version of TMZ. And there's a genuine fear among AI researchers that one day, in the wise words of Sam Altman, it could all go quite wrong. So this is where we end this video. Do you all think the reign of AI can come to an end? You can comment below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.